Aries, hello Aries, hello. Oh my goodness, there's a lot that is going on in your zodiac sign. Yes, we have the solar eclipse that is taking place on April 8th, which is a major event. Yes, there's also the new moon in Aries. Mercury is going retro retrograde in Aries on April 1st. And Aries is ruled by Mars. Hmm? The god of war, Aries. Oh my goodness. Okay, fire energy. Let's see. I'm excited. Intense, it's gonna be intense. Cleansing, intense, okay, and cleansing. Yes, and healing with the four swords. Okay. So, Aries, April 2024, we also have temperance, moderation, balancing the energies that will occur, 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 occur. You know what I mean. Five of Wands. This is, is intense. It is intense. Okay. Aries. The Moon. Mm -hmm. The Moon is what we don't see. What we don't see coming. Okay. Mm. What we don't see coming. Aries. Two of Cups. No, sorry, this is the Four of Cups. I got excited. Four of Cups. What we don't see coming, yeah? You see, this person is being offered uh, the Ace of Cups. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. Aries, are we ready? Yes, we are. So let's do this for Aries, please. April 2024 for Aries. The sun. Solar eclipse. The sun. You saw the moon and the sun. So maybe some of you are experiencing a dark moment in your life. The sun will come out, that's for sure. And this is the sun that will bring also the light, the sun that will bring healing and clarity. Aries' first card for you is you, the king of wands. <laughs> okay? Born a leader. You're leading the way. And this, it's interesting because this man in this, in this card is blind. Yes. But he is leading the way. So again, he's not seeing. The moon. He's not seeing. He sees with, 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 with the eyes of, the, of, of his heart. The sun. Mm -hmm. And the third eye. So, let, let's move on, Aries. Oh my goodness, we have the Queen of Wands. <laughs> so we have the masculine and the feminine energy of Aries here. Yes? Beautiful. Beautiful. Fireworks. Creativity. Five of Cups. So, okay. This is the dark I was talking about earlier, the dark aspect. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. The high priestess. The five of wands. Okay, and 
the fool. A new start, a new chapter, a new beginning. Changing your focus from the problem back to love. Back to infinite possibilities. Okay. You do see the light. You see the, the light at the end of the tunnel. You do see that. But there is, as I said, there is a lot that is going on. Knight of Cups, Ten of Wands, the Wheel of Fortune, Ten of Swords, Two of Swords, Queen of Cups. Again, we see um, someone here being offered a cup. Mm -hmm. And hope is being restored with the star. Okay. I am also seeing a couple here. The king and the queen of wands. This is a, a power couple. A couple. So maybe you have been experiencing um, issues in your relationships, Aries. Or a certain relationship with a specific person that could be a love interest, a family member, a boss, uh, a co-worker. Mm. This could also be an ex for some of you. So, there is a cycle, a repetitive cycle, that needs to come to an end. Because the result, the outcome, is, is the same. And we're not satisfied with the outcome here. We're not satisfied with the dynamic... Of, of this connection. Clarifying the King of Wands, please. Clarifying the King of Wands. King of Wands for Aries. We have the Two of Swords. Okay, so we, we, we are aware, we are aware here, Aries, that we need to modify a pattern, modify a behavior, yes? Modify a pattern, a behavior. And I get in, in order to, dig, to get a, a different result, a different outcome. It's crucial, I'm hearing. It's crucial. Right? So, again, you are, uh, I guess, you are in this, in, in this point in time that is very important for you. To choose a path, to choose a way, to choose a goal, a destination. Decide. Decisions, yes? So what is it going to be? It feels like there is no space or room for any other... Sorry, no. So there is no room, there is no space, no time to waste. <coughs> it's now or never. Oh my goodness, okay. It's now or never. Knight of Swords. Hmm. Hmm. 
How to find, please, a Two of Swords with the King of Wands for Aries. Two of Swords and the King of Wands for Aries, please. Thank you. We have death. The end. Complete. Finito. Full stop. Death. Transformation. Yes. Death brings something new. Mm. So death <coughs> brings something new. Can find please death for Aries? The tower. So again we have this like oh, uh, Mm. Again, this is intense because we 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 are not able to 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 postpone. We even if yes, because maybe we were like procrastinating making this decision, postponing. But there is no again room or space to do that. It's now or never. Yes, and it does bring things like things come like. It's like 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 a wave, like an unexpected wave or tsunami. That oh my god, I got goosebumps when I said that tsunami thing. Oh my goodness. Mm. Okay. No. Anyway, whatever. So where was I? Where, 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 okay, where was I? Um. So again, this is what I'm hearing. There, there is a, there's a, a, a tsunami of, of events that are coming towards you, and, and maybe it does require from you, Aries, to take like a hey, a fast uh, decision. Yes, you 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 need to do it now. I, I, again, yes, now, now, now. And for for some of you, this has to do with your work, your career, your three D life, Eight of Pentacles. To find the tower for Aries. Thank you. We have the Nine of Cups. So the Nine of Cups is our wish, is our wish fulfillment, our desire, what we want. Yeah, what, what do we want? So again, this event or events that will occur, occur, oh my goodness, occur, yes, um, will take you to your Ninth Cup. But again, I'm going to be honest here. It's, it's not like the energies are not calm, are not peaceful, are not calm, calm. It's, it's a bit of, of, of a, a chaotic energy that needs to take place in, in order for, for peace and, and harmony to, 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 to return in your life, to, to yes in your life and, and within you. Okay, Aries? So, okay. Again, clarity. Clarity. So there is the silence before the storm, then there's the storm, and then again, there's peace. Oh, okay. Yes. Clarifying, please, the Queen of Wands for Aries. Clarifying the Queen of Wands for Aries, please. Thank you. We have the King of Pentacles. Now, this is Earth Energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. But this is the King of the 3D reality. Okay? And his arms are wide open. And we also have the sun here in the background. Okay. And again, I'm seeing these hands open and open. <clears throat> ready to receive mm. 
Mm. It's not about no, no. It's 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 about receiving yes, but it's also. It's all about giving and receiving, actually. This is what I want to say. It's all about giving and receiving here. What you give, what you receive. So giving and receiving. Energy, time. Effort, the devil is here also, uh, and, and, and the devil is out of, of balance, so the devil is showing us that something is out of balance that needs to be restored, okay? Do we find the queen of wands with the king of pentacles? We have the emperor, okay, and again, this emperor could be anyone. It's a masculine fig figure, a masculine energy. It's a boss. It's, it's a husband. It's, it's, it's <coughs> a father figure. The emperor is also Mars energy. The emperor is also Aries energy. The protector, the protector, okay. You need to protect yourself. You need to protect your energy. You need to protect what you have accomplished, like your accomplishments, your, your yes, what your em empire, you need to protect that and you will. Because there is no other choice but to do that. And again, by choosing to protect yourself and, 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 and the energy, the people around you and so on and so forth. Again, we see here that there is a need for something to change, for something to, to come to an end. And there is also this sense of loss with the Five of Cups. There is the sense of loss we lose something to gain something. Page of Cups. Again, there is this element of surprise. Could be that this is like new love entering your life or a new job opportunity, yes? Or a, a, a path that, that you did not even uh, like Considered. Aries. Clarifying the Emperor for Aries, please. Thank you. We have the Ten of Pentacles. Again, we have that 3D energy here with the, with the Pentacles. Abundant energy. Yes. Abundance, prosperity. And, 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 and union. Union. Union, union of hearts, knight of cups, union of, of uh, collaborations, coming together here, coming together. So again, I'm seeing that calm, calm after, after the storm. This is what I'm seeing. To find the Amber and the Ten of Pentacles for Aries, please. Yeah, Seven of, seven of, uh, uh, of Pentacles. And the Sun, again. Now in this Seven of Pentacles... So you have something in your hands, Aries. 
You have something in your hands. You're carrying wisdom. You have something in your hands. It's yours. So, how will you make this grow? Considering, reconsidering. Is this the right job? Is this the right opportunity? Is this the right person? What will this bring me in, in, in the long run, right? Like seriously reconsidering things. Yes, because again, it's like you don't have no other choice but to do that. You've reached um, your limits. Find please the Seven of Pentacles for Aries. Seven of Wands. I'm also getting like global messages here, but uh, okay, I am strong messages. Yes, I, I do see a riot. I mean, I feel this riot, riot, or or, or it's like it's gonna take place in April. Like I do see people on the streets, pro protesting, and but yeah, again, this is something else. So let's move on. Five of Cups. Can you find, please, the Five of Cups for Aries? Thank you. Eight of Wands. Wow, that's fast. This is really fast. And I get it has to do with your home, your business, your work, your finances, your career. Mm. The, again, there is a shift. There is a change that you cannot control. And again, I'm getting this fast, fast energy, fast movement. You need to make this decision now, today, now. There is no time for you to think about it. Refine, please, the Eight of Wands with the Four of Wands and the Five of Cups for Aries, please. Yes, we also have the Knight of Cups here. It's good, Aries. It is good. Yes, it is. This is the Ace of Wands with the Knight of Cups. I love, I love this Ace of Wands because we have a white canvas and we can draw whatever we want now. Yes, the last canvas is, is, is like, okay. We gave it away or we, we, we sold it or we burned it, whatever, right? So now we have a, a white canvas to start all over again with an open heart. And again, I am seeing someone approaching you. For those of you that have been single for quite some time, I do see that. It's, 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 it's something new, something fresh that will bring excitement and enthusiasm. Aries, yes. To find please, the Knight of Cups with the Ace of Wands for Aries. Thank you. Ooh. And this is what the Nine of Pentacles is like. Um, yeah. We have the Nine of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles. So you are like, um, how can I say the, uh, you have your options, right? You have options. So you're reevaluating your options here. You're very focused. Um, methodical, strategic, stra strategic, methodical, strategic. Yes, no. It's like there's no maybe or perhaps. It's like yes, no. Again, you're very determined. 
Um. Mm. Yes, page of wands. Then we have this excitement uh, of clearing away the, the clutter. Oh, okay. Clearing our our, our, our life from, from, from energies, people. Lost causes. This is what I'm hearing. Lost causes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Moving on to the high priestess. Moving on to the high priestess. Thank you. We have strength. Mm -hmm. Using our intuition, li listening, not using, yeah, listening to our intuition, trusting our intuition. Yes? Finding the strength to take the actions that we are shown to take. <coughs> Again, it does require a lot of strength, a lot of strength to maybe end things, right? To put, uh, it's hard. It's hard, right? To end things, to end a uh, life uh, um, that we we, 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 we we were comfortable in, that we knew. But yes, it's, it's, it, but you are determined. Again, with the Knight of Swords here, you are determined. Nothing is stopping you here. Mm -mm. Only your own self, but I'm not seeing that. I'm not seeing you stopping you. Not at all. I'm seeing the opposite. Five of Wands. Can we find the Five of Wands for Aries? Thank you, Spirit. Knight of Wands. I said nothing stopping you. Nothing. And again, you're moving away from drama, conflict, drama. You're moving away from that. You're leveling up. Yeah, you are leveling up, Aries, with a clear mind. Also, I'm hearing with a clear conscience, consciousness, conscious, conscious, consciousness, conscious. Oh my goodness. Thank you, please. The magician. Like, it, you are sure here, 100%. There are no doubts. There are no doubts. But again, I keep seeing a surprise. I keep seeing something coming in that... Uh, comes in in a, in a uh, pleasant, unexpected way. And for some of you, as I said, this uh, has to do with love. Okay? No, an opportunity, a love, love opportunities here. We have the Hierophant. The Hierophant, huh? Interesting. Victory. Six of Wands. Mm -hmm. So you're heading towards victory no matter what. Your victory. Your victory. Knight of Swords. Why? Mm, because of the Ace of Cups. Now we go back to love. Yes. Reevaluating a existing connection. Some of you are. Because we also have the lovers here. We have the Ace of Cups. The Ten of Swords, excuse me, the Nine of Swords. Maybe you are having sleepless nights, thinking of a, a, of a person, or trying to figure out a way to, like, fix things or end things. <laughs> yes, okay. Okay, Aries. Okay. 
clarifying judgment for Aries. Yeah, Seven of Swords, Wheel of Fortune. Again, the sun is coming out, really bringing a lot of clarity. Maybe you have already received clarity with this, uh, with, 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 with the, the full moon that took place on, on uh, March 25th. Yes. Because this started on March 25th with, with, the, with, the, with the lunar eclipse. Yeah, it's like a, yeah, it's like a, a, a very significant time frame. And now we, we have the solar eclipse on the April 8th. So it's like a, it's like a portal has been uh, opened. Uh, there's, yes, a portal. Yes. So this is cycling out from your life. This, 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 this nine of swords energy, this seven of swords energy. I mean, we do see a thief here, right? We see someone that we cannot trust. There's someone here that we cannot trust. So again, this energy is cycling out from our life. <coughs> And not because we are rest restoring trust when it comes to this person or, or business or company or boss or whatever. It's because we are restoring trust within us with the fool. We are trusting us, our judgment, our intuition. Yes. But also trusting the divine, our spirit guides. Mm hmm Confine the fool. Oh, can we find the fool for Aries? Thank you. We have the devil and the two of cups. Listen, listen. Give me one moment. Some of you are in connections that are toxic. Yes. Yes. We have the two of cups and the devil here. Mm, I saw the, yes, the two of cups in the beginning of this reading. So some of you are in um, toxic connections or you have a toxic way of viewing connections. Sorry. But let's be honest here. We, 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 yes, we all do that sometimes, right? Yes, it's, it's again our patterns that we need to modify and change. Our patterns. Our patterns. Aries. This is all also the love, the love for ourselves. When you love yourself, you trust yourself. You trust your judgment. For Aries, yes? Fox, clever. You are swift and smart. Solutions to problems are easy, easily found. Always listen to your instincts. Resources around you. Be open to romance. Aries, this is what I got for you. <laughs> Take care. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs>